Guinness World Records. Something I'm confused as to why it exists. So Guinness World Records, blah, 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 blah. You know, people trying to be famous over something that no one cares about, which is fine. No one cares about me and no one cares about you. And we are in this circle together, but we can care about each other if you would like. Obviously, if you don't want to, I'm not wasting my little care. Most toilet seats broken by the head in one minute. 44 toilets. See, you know, the person who's done that just has no brain, like has no brain to start with. And then imagine, imagine having to practice for that. What the fuck? 40, mate, my head hurts just thinking about one. How do you break a toilet seat? Jesus. Most snails on the face. So that was that horrifying. Like, that looks something out of a horror film. That is straight out of the new Alien film. Jesus, Lord. Loudest burp. 109 decibels. That's impressive. An Italian Elisa Caganoni. 107 decibels. I'm getting, that sounds incredible, but I don't know what that means. I don't know what a decibel is. Like, I know it's how you measure sound, but I don't know how high, like, one is. Typing all numbers from one to one million in words, not, oh my god. Well, it took him 16 years. Oh my god. It Some people are just sad. Imagine, how do you do that? I'm sorry. How do you waste your time doing that? Like, you know, something that no one would know about unless they searched top 10 dumbest Guinness World Records. That is what you're known for. You spent 16 years or whatever doing it. <sighs> Lord, have mercy. The longest distance pulled by a horse. Again. I don't care. Farthest... We, we can squirt milk from our eyes. Oh my gosh. Nine feet and two inches. Jesus fudge. Most rotations hanging from a power trim. No way. 148 rotations going like that. Bruh. You have to notice all these are like thickos. You know what I mean? Just people who just have no no idea that they're taking the piss out of. And it's almost sad. Like, you know, people with a bit of autism or something like that. Yeah, I'll hang from the fucking drill and spin 148 times in one minute. That sounds like a great idea for my general health and well-being. And hey, I might also beat a Guinness World Record while I'm at it. Fudge it, hell, son. A strangest diet. I can think of a few people I'd suggest for that. Bicycles, televisions grocery carts he consumed an airplane over over two two years oh yeah so he, he tried eating a banana and a hard-boiled egg and thought now nah, this ain't for me this ain't the life i want i'm gonna start consuming objects i'm just trying to process how you would eat a plane like is it just like a bit every minute like i wonder what his you know toilet trips were like D does acid burn through that i mean it must do did he start flying that would have been impressive in that case hand me the airplane right now i'll start chewing it today two day honorable mentions fastest bed making <sighs> i think my mum would win that honestly she's well good at it most people dressed as smurfs largest dog wedding now that should be number one that's the best thing i've ever heard i want to see the largest dog wedding ever most uh as she, as she reads a firm and looks like it oh my god so most guinness world you could pass him on the street and you wouldn't even notice you wouldn't but has to be placed in, as he holds the most guinness world records of anyone in the world 550 records and he currently holds 120 and as you probably guess a lot of them are completely stupid doing 20,000 jumping jacks running a marathon while bouncing a baseball cap on your head jumping rope on a po all stupid yet hilarious I'm chuckling just thinking about this man. You know, he sounds like a barrel of laughs. Catching 170 eggs without breaking one. Dude, I'd fucking do that. Hey, mom, get me 76 eggs. Now. Actually, 77. Now, nah, fuck it. Get me 100. Fucking do it then. But why have I just waffled so long? Watch this shit. You, you just... Sounds like your dog when you throw like three balls for him and it's over 25 degrees. Like he's panting like a fucking boomer right now. I mean, <laughs> like, can you? This is an award. You get a certificate. You end up in a book after doing this. We didn't not need this. <laughs> oh, that's fucking bowel. Foul! So this is the most table tennis balls bounced against a wall in 30 seconds. I mean... Come on! Yeah. 
you know, this is the perfect example of what you should not go home and tell your parents you've done today. Oh my God, mum, I set a new Guinness World Record. No way, sweetie. What did you... Oh, I'm so proud of you. I spat a dirty ping pong ball at a wall for 30 seconds and caught it. You did what, honey? You did... You did what? And that's what you should end on. Now, I was going to attempt this, but... Why? Why? Why should I do that? I don't need to win this. And plus, I don't have a table tennis ball, which was a slight hiccup. I thought maybe I could use a football. Turns out it doesn't work so well. But yeah, I'll leave you with that and you can uh, laugh. Have you got a Guinness World Record? Is it anything that is, you know, worth sharing? Or is it, you know, spitting on a ping pong ball and catching it in your mouth while horrible noises fly out? Oh, I hate people who eat loudly and that's like the worst fucking noise, isn't it? Like... <laughs> It makes me gag just thinking about it. Holy shit, motherfucker. I like, fuck that. And look, I'm glad this guy's got some name in the history books, but I think I, I would just rather be no one. I'd rather be no one. And I am no one, so... Hallelujah. But I'm not s spitting against a wall. <laughs> uh, trying to get in a book that no one reads. Like, fuck me and the arsehole that call me Frankie McCoy. Like, Jesus, son!